Sorry about that, you guys. I forgot to mention one other thing during this quit type of video. So that means this is going to be a second and final part for this video, that is. So I just wanted to mention something else about Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas, the Disney direct -to video 1997 sequel slash Christmas holiday movie, that is. So, I want to give you guys another reason why, and decided to give you guys another reason why about Beauty and the Beast the Enchanted Christmas, that is. That I've decided to go ahead and do the normal and long opening and closing to all my VHS copies of that Disney direct-to-video sequel Christmas holiday movie itself, that is. Another reason that I've decided and wanted to do and just just going to go ahead and do the normal and long opening. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and just start doing the normal and long opening and closing to all my VHS copies of Beauty and the Beast, the Enchanted Christmas, that is, is because I exactly cannot remember when's the last time I watched this sequel, this Christmas movie itself, last time that is, unfortunately. So I know it has been years since. I have last watched this movie, this Christmas holiday movie itself, that is, of Beauty and the Beast, the Enchanted Christmas, that is. So, uh, let me tell you guys a story here. Even though I cannot remember when is the last time I've watched this Disney direct-to-video sequel Christmas holiday movie itself from Disney, back in 1997 when that direct-to-video sequel was released back then on November 11th, 1997, which was Veterans Day of 1997 and all that. So, yeah. Yeah, it's been like a very long time. I exactly cannot remember when the last time I've watched this. The last time I've watched Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas, I know it has been a few years ago. Like, it's been like so many years since I've last watched it back then, the last time I've watched that Christmas movie and all that. So, so that is another reason why I decided to go ahead and immediately, excuse me, I decided to go ahead and immediately do the normal and long opening and close into all my VHS copies of this, of this Christmas Disney movie sequel and all that. So... Yeah. Hang on a second, you guys. Hold on. Excuse me. Sorry about me burping once again. So, sorry about that little of a hiccup there. So, yeah. So, I do apologize for that, you guys. But that's okay, though. It happens. So, yeah. And now, the main reason why I've... I've had to make part two, which is going to be the final part of this video, is because I forgot to mention something at the end of part one, and I just feel like just talking over it and give you guys a brief conversation about Beauty and the Beast, the Enchanted Christmas, about the how long was the last time I've watched this direct-to-video sequel and all that. I know it has been a very long time, for a few years and all that, since the last time I've watched this Christmas holiday movie and all that from Disney. So, yeah. But even though I can't exactly remember when the last time I've watched this Christmas holiday sequel to Beauty and the Beast and all that. So, yeah. So, I cannot exactly remember the last time I've watched this Christmas movie and all that. So, yeah. But even though I do remember it has been like years a few years ago, the last couple of years since the last time I've watched it and haven't watched it since then, the last time, which was like a few years ago. Um, I'm guessing maybe 2017. I can't exactly remember. I know it has been a, a very super long time since I have not watched this movie lately during the holidays and all that. So pretty much Christmas every year throughout the November and December until Christmas is over and all that. So, yeah. I just have no understand. I just don't understand why I haven't gotten myself around to 
watch Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas, every holiday season of the year and all that. So, um, I just can't believe it's been like a very long time since I've last watched Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas during the holidays. Every certain year and all that. So, I, I remember watching it a few times back in like 2016 and probably 2017 so i'm guessing i have not watched this movie since um this christmas holiday movie since either probably 2017 or probably 2018 something like that as far as i'm guessing but but even though i exactly do not remember when the last time i've watched beauty and the beast the enchanted christmas during the christmas holiday season and all that throughout December and stuff like that pretty much so yeah so as of for um for the year 2024 since it's already November of since it's already November 2024 around the beginning of November 2024 which is still going around that is as of for this year, 2024, for November, I am going to be starting off really early this year because of that main inconvenience conversation that the last time I've watched this Christmas movie was like a, a very long time, which was um, a few years ago, either like 2017 or 2018. I cannot exactly remember back then the last time I watched this Christmas movie back then last time so yeah so guys i really do i i just don't understand why that i haven't watched beauty and the beast the enchanted christmas throughout the holidays in so very long for an extremely long time since probably i'm just gonna i'm just gonna guess it it's probably maybe back in 2017 or 2018 i can't exactly remember like i said before but but i am gonna watch this christmas movie again for the very first time ever in such a long time since around either 2017 or 2018 since the last time i watched the entire movie of beauty and the beast the enchanted christmas during the holidays every throughout the year of throughout every single year during the holidays and all that so so what i'm gonna do is is i'm gonna start doing the normal and long opening and closing so that way i can just watch this christmas movie again for the very first time ever in such a long time on all my vhs copies of beauty and the beast the enchanted christmas while I'll record the long opening and closing to to all my vhs copies of those so yeah and also, I really want to watch this Christmas movie again since it's been like a few years ago since the last time I I ever saw it and the last time I watched it last time back then. So, so because I really enjoy watching Beauty and the Beast, The Enchanted Christmas every year of the season, of, of the holiday season and all that. So, I remember liking, I remember watching this christmas movie before a very long time ago back in the past and all that throughout like the 2010s and all that so throughout like one decade one certain decade ago i should say so um so guys i can't i just cannot wait to watch this christmas holiday movie again of beauty and the beast the enchanted christmas again as soon as i can while i'll, I'll go ahead and record the long opening and close into all my vhs copies of this christmas holiday movie and all that so so that will me so that will give me some time to watch it on all my vhs copies that i have so far for right now at the moment until i get the 1997 canadian vhs which i also will be watching which i will also be watching i will also be watching the 1997 canadian vhs and also will do the normal and long opening and closing to that tape as well too once after i get that tape in the mail soon 
since I just recently ordered that tape from eBay earlier tonight and all that. So, yeah. Um, so, that's what's going to be my planning here from for this year right before December starts. So, this is going to be a an early start for me this year because a this will be an early start for me of this year for 2024 since I haven't watched this Christmas movie in so long, that is. Back then, and I've mentioned the reasons why that is. So, yeah. And I really love the 1991 animated classic version of the original Beauty and the Beast. And along with um, the third movie, which is called Belle's Magical World as well, too. I really love the all three of the Beauty and the Beast movies animated trilogy and all that so yeah <sighs> yeah i cannot believe it's been that long since the last time i've watched this christmas movie during the holidays and all that probably like 2017 or maybe 2018 i i like i said before as far as i'm guessing but even though i cannot remember the last time i've exactly watched this christmas holiday movie of Beauty and the Beast the Enchanted Christmas last time back then so so this will be a good time for me to watch this Christmas movie again as an early start for me for this year for 2024 to be exact so yeah so I just want to give you guys a heads up about this quick conversation I'm making to you guys during the second and final part of this quick type of video and all that so yeah anyways so I figured I'd go ahead and make a part two, which is going to be a second and final part of this quick type of video. Since I decided to go ahead and make a second and final part, since I forgot to mention something and just feel like talking a little bit more during this this type of it during this type of video that is. So yeah. Anyways, so that will be it for part two, which is going to be the second and final part of those VHS tapes. I'm going to do the normal and long opening and closing to all my VHS copies of Beauty and the Beast the Enchanted Christmas which is going to be an early start for me for the for the for this time around for the year for for the year 2024 and all that since I haven't watched and haven't seen the sequel in such a long time for like for like a few years ago back then for like so many years and all that so yeah I I just don't understand why I haven't watched I just don't understand why that I haven't been watching this Christmas holiday movie every year for the holiday season and all that and 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 had to wait for that for that long for like so many years and all that so I really love this Christmas movie so much as as well as the the other two animated Beauty and the Beast movies as well too the original along with the original 1991 animated classic version of beauty and the beast along with bell's magical world the third one itself and the final beauty and the beast final film in the animated trilogy as well too so yeah so i just i just don't understand and it's been i just can't believe it's been that long since i have been watching this movie every christmas and every during the holiday season as well too for every single year and all that so so this is going to be a good early start for me and all that so yeah since i'm planning on watching all my vhs copies of this christmas holiday movie since i really love this christmas movie so much and this disney direct video sequel from 1997 as well too so yeah anyways so I just want to give you guys the facts and give you guys a, another conversation about this Christmas holiday movie that I haven't watched in so many years and all that. So yeah, so this is going to be a good start for me starting early as well too around the beginning of November. Even though the holidays are not around just yet until next month and... And even though December hasn't started as of yet, though, but I'm just going to go ahead for this year and start off very early for this year since because of that reason there, since I haven't watched this Christmas movie in like years and all that since probably 2017 or 2018. I can't exactly remember, like I said before, when 
was the last time I've watched this Christmas holiday movie from Disney and all that. So, yeah. So, I'm going to go ahead and end this video right now and just get it done immediately. So, see you guys later on in the next video. So, see you guys later on in the next video and bye for now, everybody. See you guys later, fellas.